My New Year's resolution in 2024 is to be a better husband. Before anybody laughs in the room, I'm going to be a better husband. I'm going to be more present in my wife's world and care more about her. I know she doesn't believe me, but honestly, I am. I am. I am, at least for a few days. All right. So it's come to this. My New Year's resolution. I think I'm finally going to take my inhaler before work and try to blow my nose less in this room. Chris and Jack hate it. I got to do it. But I'll try to blow my nose less. Just for them. Chris was bragging this morning. I've never blown my nose in this room. How many have you done, Matt? So we'll see if I can cut her down in the new year. One last one for old times sake. <laughs> How awesome was that catch, by the way? <laughs> okay, in the past, I have always said that my New Year's resolution was to be nicer to Matt, but I realized I just don't think that's gonna happen. So my new New Year's resolution is to be less controlling and not worry as much. Is, I there, that. is there a chance of this happening? Probably not. This year I'm gonna get back to reading. 2023 was a really bad year for reading for me, but 2024, look out, I'm gonna read all the books. Yo, 2024, easy. I already talked about this on air, but I'm excited. Um, my resolution is I wanna try as many local breweries in Kiss and Country, that's uh, Edmonton and surrounding areas. So if you've got a favorite brewery, drop it in the comments below and I'm going to make my wife make a spreadsheet and then we'll map it out. So if you own a local brewery, coming for you. You're already a better husband than me. What does that say? <laughs>